hi guys welcome back to my channel so today's video is going to be my updated eyebrow routine i haven't done one in about two years the one that i have up now is pretty old so i just thought i'd show you guys how i do my brows now so i'm just taking a spoolie and just brushing my eyebrow into place so that when i fill it in i can see the shape that i'm going for and i'm using my anastasia dip brow to outline my brows and also her um number 12 brush so I'm just tracing the bottom half of my brow, following the shape that I already have. I'm not creating any new shapes or, you know, anything wild. I'm just following the natural shape of my brow. Now I'm going to do the same thing to the top. I'm just brushing my eyebrow hair sort of downward so I can see the shape at the top of my brow. And I'm just again following the natural shape of my brow and also creating my tail because my brow is kind of short so I like to extend my tail a little bit. To fill in my brow, I'm going to use this NYX eyebrow gel, which I really have been loving. It's like, it's sort of similar to the Makeup Forever Aqua Brow. It's really like waterproof. It stays on all day. It doesn't smudge or budge or I don't have problems with my eyebrows like <laughs> rubbing off or anything. So I really like this and it's only about six bucks and I'm filling in my entire brow with this product. Always make sure to go back with the spoolie and kind of brush through my brows so that there aren't any harsh lines or anything. And towards the front of my brow, I use very little product, like very little. I don't like the front of my brow to be too harsh, so I make sure to really spoolie it out and use a very light hand. And now I'm just cleaning up my brow with some concealer. To me, this is the most important part because it just makes the brows look 10 times better. And yeah, I'm just using the concealer that I usually use for like underneath my eyes to highlight because I like the whole, I like my brow to be a little bit highlighted. You can use like a concealer that's close to your skin tone if you want to, but I just use my, the same one I use underneath my eye. And I'm just cleaning up the bottom half of my brow. I also like to take like a concealer brush and just tap the front of my brow very lightly just to get rid of any excess product. And this is totally optional. I sometimes like to outline the top of my brows. You don't have to though. It just, I just feel like it makes my brows look a lot sharper and I like a, a really bold brow. But if you want your brows to be more natural looking then don't do this. And this is a finished brow look. I hope you guys really liked this video. If you did, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and also leave me some comments down below. Um, yeah, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.